on this box, under this box, around this box, behind this box. No. No. All right, box thoroughly inspected. Good. Boy, you can... these ones have slightly different models. I think the previous ones. At least, I think the changeup occurred a little while ago, but yeah, like that little dongle on the bottom there. I think that's a change up from the first generation of these bots that we saw ages ago. Our enemy has strong opinions about Independence Day. Well, oh, that's the sound of a new generating tile. It creates more of these. have to go back to basics. <laughs> While also accounting for our newfound preference for the left foot. Gotta continue working the angles. Ah. Got some range on that. Reverse. You have to punish it. And on a stomp. Nice hearty stomp. And we drop the foot. For stomps, it seems pretty reliably that uh, it will be with whatever your current trailing leg is. So by appropriately aligning ourselves up, we can work the left foot while maintaining our, our ground advantage here. Thank <laughs> you. 
There's that mighty axe. There we go, Lefty is caught up quite nicely with the primary leg. Although really, the game doesn't give you any innate handedness, all your, your sides are equal. It's all a matter of how you develop them and how you position yourself. You decide. go dextral, you want to go sinister, it's all up to you. The day that Pile Driver fills us will be the saddest day in the ring. Highly dependable standby. Skull damage is extremely valuable. Body exp is kind of universally applicable. And any opportunity to get into the stomps and the ground techniques is just straight up good times all around. That's right, friend, you stay down. You are going nowhere. hit point off of that. Very rapidly climbing the HP scale. It's good. Definitely want all of these numbers in high uncomfortable locations. Quite quick enough on the step. Oh well, let's give him the mighty boot. I'm not sure how that was supposed to work, but. Well, here we are. Like defense. Huh. Yellow cube day.
Come on, uh, playing nice. Now we stomp. There will be no further mercy. No more fooling around. Only justice. Probably be out of these soon and then resume, you know, president saving, what have you. You do not get to leave. I decide when you may leave. Connor Slater puts you on the ground. You remain on the ground. Alright, we're out of those. Good stuff. Another generator room full of more of you. Oh my. We might be in this corridor for a while. It's full of meat. Tasty, tasty meat. Deadly, poisonous meat. Whoa, wait, what? Hold on. That's fifth combo bar. We have it. We've attained the full five hits. Combos. It's five hit punches, and five hits of the mighty boot. 
Also really means that we should attend to the poison that's devouring us, but for now, the boots. I get, I get it. Relax. Warning system. What's next? Watch it, another fucking tile generating even more monsters to brawl. Let me... Let's look forward here and see if we can confirm the existence of a save point. Because there's a lot of mon- we, there's two more generator tiles of monster back there waiting to be beat the fuck up. And another up here. There's Llama here. That's a lot of mon- that's enough that I would like to like discover a save point and maybe grind through all of those off camera. Perhaps it's some kind of montage. I don't think we need a love of all humans driving us for this mission. I mean, Don Secret Service kind of just needs to believe in his country. Even then, not necessarily the whole country. You know, the governing body, ruling class, and so forth. He doesn't need to be some sort of grand egalitarian friend to all animals. Just Johnny Slater. Yeah, there were all them, all them monsters back there. I Means there's a lot of potential X back there, and an open question as to how much of that X the game expects to have collected. Either way, we do have a save tube. Between us and progress, it simply remains the question of if we, uh, folks would rather push ahead or turn back and uh, enter montage state. 